Hello, this is a video on how to play Acme Solitaire. Um, Acme is a variant of Canfield Solitaire. Um, Canfield Solitaire, just for a refresher, is a Solitaire card game with perhaps the lowest probability of winning out of any Solitaire in the world, out of all of them. Um, it's very, very hard, um, and it's named after Richard A. Canfield, who, I guess, created the game. And so... The game is notorious for being hard, right? It's very, very hard. And so uh, we'll talk about um, how to play, right? It is similar, but it is does have some key differences. So what you'll need to set up um, is you'll need a standard 52-card deck, right? The objective of the game is to build four foundations up by suit using a standard 52-card deck. Um, in terms of the foundation, you have four foundation piles, right? As you can see here, at the beginning, all the aces are dealt face up to the foundation piles. And then you also have um, a reserve pile here. And in this reserve pile, 13 cards um, are dealt face down to the reserve pile. The top card of the reserve pile is then turned face up. You'll then have four tableau piles. Each pile is dealt one card face up to begin with. After dealing the cards to the reserve foundation, and tableau. The remaining cards are placed in a stockpile. You'll also start out with an empty waste pile, so set aside some space for an empty waste pile. The foundation piles are built up by suit starting from ace to king. Um, on the tableau, cards are played in descending order uh, by suit. And so if you're stacking cards on the tableau, um, it must be of the same suit and one rank lower. You can um, actually stack cards in the tableau from the reserve or the waste as well as between the tableaus. Um, only the top card of any tableau pile is available for play. Uh, the empty tableau pile is always filled first with the top card from the reserve pile. If there is no card in the reserve, then it can be filled with a card of your choice. Right? And so the top card from the reserve pile can be played to the foundation or the tableau uh, whenever a card is removed from the reserve pile, the face down card of the reserve pile, aka the next card, is then turned face up. Um, you can deal from the stockpile anytime, which deals one card face up onto the waste pile. Um, one redeal is allowed, so when all the cards from the stockpile are moved to the waste pile, it can be moved back to the stockpile right, by flipping the deck over. And you can do that once. Uh, the top card from the waste pile can be moved onto the tableau or foundation piles. The game ends once all cards are moved onto the foundation piles. And so if that was confusing, essentially build up the foundation piles. Um, you can move cards just essentially however you wish. There's not too many restrictions. Um, just note that um, between tableaus, if you're moving a card to the tableau, it must be one rank lower of the opposite color. And an empty tableau pile is first filled with the reserve pile. Once the reserve is empty, you can then fill it with any card. Okay. So let us begin Canfield Solitaire. It's gonna be quite fun, right? Um, remember, tableau is built descending of the uh, same suit. Okay. And so this will be quite hard, but that's okay. Let us sort of give it a shot. So we got a two of diamonds there, beautiful. But we're not really able to do much here. Why? Because these cards are all having a giant gap in them. Okay, so this 10 allows us to be placed right there. We can't do much with any of these cards, really. And this is, do note that this is a game of some probability as well. Some games of Acme, right, are unwinnable right you cannot win them and also one more key note is that you cannot move an entire pile you can only ever move the top card in some solitaires you can uh, move the entire pile right but so you can move piles in this case you can only ever move the top card at a time so we're trying our best not going so well though if I am being honest. Of 
card can't be used. Nope. Nope. None of these cards can be used. So this is brutal. Okay. There we go. I'm not going to touch that card. There we go. Oops. I was wrong there in that. Remember, the rule is if you have an empty tableau, you must first empty out all the cards from the reserve pile into it. And only then can you go ahead and begin. Um, first, if you have an empty tableau, you must use a card from the reserve pile to fill it. And so, in this case, we must use a card from the reserve pile to fill it. Although I do not hope, but I must. Okay. So we have a decent set of cards here. I really wanted to get that king. As that would help. Right, if I could start off a tableau pile with the king. That would help tremendously. I do get the eight there. That's beautiful. Uh, that was close. The Eight of Diamonds cannot be used. Right, so now this is just a demo round, really. Uh, the rules are quite simple, but we'll sum it up one more time. Uh, after in a couple of minutes. I right, do keep in mind some games are unwinnable. Uh, if I could only get that 9 there, and as well as that 10, a lot of this does come down. And so notice how this game is unwinnable, right? We can't win. And so that essentially wraps up how to play Acme, right? In order to sum it up simply, rather than give a complicated formal version of the rules, because sometimes when you try to state rules formally, um, it does complicate them a bit. And so just to simply put it, in Acme, right, you build up four foundation piles um, from ace to king, right? Um, you have your four tableau piles. Um, you can move cards between the tableaus, provided that they are one rank lower of the same suit, right? Uh, you can move cards um, anywhere between um, just... If you feel like you can move a card, chances are you can move it to where you want to, right? Um, essentially, just note that you cannot move onto the reserve pile or onto the waste pile. Uh, you can ever only ever take from these and move onto the tableau or onto the foundation. So you can only ever move onto the tableau or onto the foundation. You can't touch these piles and add cards to them um, from over here. From the stockpile, you can add cards to the waste pile, obviously. Uh, but that's just common sense, really. Um, do note that you have 13 cards dealt face down to the reserve pile, uh, right, with the top card of the reserve pile being turned face up. You have four tableau piles, with each pile being dealt one card face up. Um, you also have a stock pile that gets made, as well as an empty waste pile. Right, and so foundation piles are built up by suits, starting from ace to king. Um, on the tableau, uh, cards are played in descending order by suit. Do note that if you ever get an empty tableau pile, it's always filled with a card from a reserve pile only. Once your reserve pile is empty, if you then have an empty tableau pile, you can fill it with whatever card you choose. You can draw one card from the stockpile anytime that deals it face up onto the waste pile. One redeal is allowed, so when all the cards from the stockpile are moved to the waste pile, you simply flip the waste pile back over and you go through the deck again. Okay, um, the top card from the waste pile can be moved as well as the reserve pile. Once you get rid of this card on the reserve pile, you flip the card underneath, right? And so these are just common sense things. Um, the game ends once you get to all the cards on the foundation piles, which is really, really hard to do. So let us give it one more go, might as well. And wait. Uh, I really wanted to keep that four, but it's okay. 
Vamos lá falar. Alright, so we have an empty tablet pile. Once again, you must, must fill it with a card from the reserve pile. Uh, in this case, that's not too bad for us. Beautiful. So far, we're off to not the best start, right? Because to win this game, it takes a lot of luck. But we're off to a good enough start here. That's unfortunate. Game is quite hard. But I am also flipping through a bit carelessly here. And so now, this is our last chance, right? We go through the deck one more time. And so this does get pretty brutal. It is a hard game to win. Um, there's no way around it. Yeah. So I don't think we can win this. Just by the nature of our hand. Oops. Okay, so... Now we're getting somewhere. I'm making some sort of progress. But the way that these hearts are laid out here, it's just, it's the worst hand you could possibly get. And your hearts are laid out like this. It is like the worst hand you could get. Are we getting any ten of diamonds here? No. Okay. Just uh, making sure. Yeah, so this is just... Right, so listen, now we're stuck. We lost the game. And so it's pretty hard to win. Um, and that's what makes it sort of fun to play, right? Because it does have a challenging factor. Some people might not like the luck. I personally don't find it too bad. Uh, but that wraps up how to play Acme. I hope you enjoyed, and thank you for watching.